the Joe Rogan experience. When did you get into kung fu movies? Wow, I got into those, like, I saw my first kung fu movie, I think, at the age of nine, right? Wow. And, you know, that was probably only my third movie experience. You know, huh. I mean? Only because, you know. Right. I mean, nowadays, you know, you can see movies anywhere. Back then in, in the early 70s. You had to go somewhere. You had to go somewhere. And listen. Oh, you got to have a tape. Oh, no, 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 no tape. VHS. No, tape. no, no this is before VHS. I'm talking Damn. about going to the movies. And like, actually seeing like my shit. first movie. Let me let me give you a little movie history for the RZA. First movie I ever saw was um, Huckleberry Finn. Wow. Okay. Down south, my cousin took me to the movies. I was maybe six or seven years old. Second time to the movie theater. Second time, uh, my uncle Hollis took me. Uh, it was a double feature. It was um, um, Star Wars and The Swarm. Right. Uh, which is and listen to how all this stuff affects my life. The Killer Bees, The Swarm, Wu Tang Killer Bees. Right. Third time to the movie theater, right? Or third or fourth time, because I saw Rocky and then I saw uh, a double feature starring Bruce Lee, which is called Fury of the Dragon, and another movie called Black Samurai starring Jim Kelly. Oh man, that was uh, a shit. And once I saw, <laughs> you know, once I saw that, yo, that nigga's fucking motherfuckers. Oh man. <laughs> He was a bad pre. He was fucking bitches and everything. everything. <laughs> Go ahead. Once Go ahead. I saw that, I was hooked on the action kung fu movies. What? Uh, okay. Yeah. And then I saw. As a double feature, you had to. As a double feature. <laughs> tender, That's like bam, bam. Tender age of, of, of nine. And mind you. That was the birth of Wu Tang Clan. Yeah. And mind you, back then, to go to the movies. You did, we, my family didn't have the dollar twenty five like to get the money to go to movies. That, it's a it may, big deal. It may take six months. <laughs> God and, damn. And, when, and when we got to the movies, we, let me tell you this family, my family. This is back when we, I was still eating meat, pork, swine. You know, we used to kill the pig. We used to raise them, name them, kill them, eat them. All right. But so now I'm in New York City, living with my grandmother. Send me the movies. Rocky's playing. Everybody's coming to see Rocky. We got to bring our Sunday dinner to the theater with us. Oh, nigga. I'm the, and yo, and my grandma. In aluminum foil? She stuffed pig feet in oh. there. Collard oh. greens, potato Joe, salad. Joe, you would never know this, Joe. Wow. In the movie in the theater. Movies. In the wow. movies. Other people got popcorn, oh, goobers. They let you bring it in? Back in those it's, days, you could, you could. But you know what? You, you also sneak, sneak it in. Too. Yeah, you got yeah, sneak yeah. it in. You, was, you had a big bag. You knew what the big bag was. Yeah, you had a sneak Nobody it in. was thirsty. One motherfucker might get a soda. Yeah, they and was Sherry. like this. Them, and and Sherry. Sherry. Like you, yo, let me yeah. tell you something. We walked for years. I walked right past all the concessions. Yeah. Everything. Popcorn, yeah. hot dogs, Twizzlers. Never had no money for that shit. And walked straight in the theater. Yeah, I'm with, I'm yeah. with him. Because, listen. Think about a dollar for a snicker. You couldn't even get a snicker when it was 40 cents. Nope. Like, you used, used to ask our parents, uh, hey, mom, you got 25 cents? What's your say? <laughs> boy, I ain't got, got good no sense. <laughs> I ain't got no sense. So I ain't got good sense, boy. You know what I mean? So we from that era. But at the end of the day, though, those movie moments, you know what I mean? They really inspired me, really took me like to a world that was different from the from the project world that I lived in, you know what I mean? Mm. And once I started seeing like movies like The Five Deadly Venoms and Thirty Six Chambers and and uh Mask Avengers and Super Ninjas, all that, when you start seeing those now, you're like in the period. Yeah. And you're seeing all this action and it's just it started resonating with me. And <laughs>